drop for this weekend's crashed ice season finale is 40 meters. And to give you a little context, that's like 10 times the size of this ramp. Yikes. I'm Danielle Michaud in Markham, where today some of the top ice cross downhill athletes are prepping for this weekend's action in Edmonton. There's no permanent tracks around for us to train on, so we have to find other ways to practice. It gives you the same feeling as being in the air on your ice hockey skates on the crashed ice tracks. Lots of the guys in Finland, they have a full-time track. Switzerland, same thing. We don't have one here, so um, I mean, we've, we have a lot of experience, so that helps. Not that it's hurt Canada's representation on the podium. Brantford, Ontario's Jacqueline Legere is the back-to-back -back world champ, and Port Credit, Ontario's Scott Croxel sits first in the standings heading into the weekend. A top two finish would land him on top of the podium, somewhere his brother Kyle stood back in 2012. You know, every course is different, so basically just going to have a lot of skating on this track with some massive jumps. Uh, they're expecting us to go 70 to 100 feet in the air. Super excited, yeah. Super excited is not how I'd feel about hurtling myself down an icy chute, but that made me wonder, how would you describe the rush of a crashed ice track? Crazy. Crazy. Ah, he used the same word. Fancy that, bros. Not surprising the Croxel brothers are on the same wavelength. They've been training and competing together in just about everything since they were kids. And while there's a lot of brotherly love, that disappears when it's go time. We try not to get in each other's way, but <laughs> we're not looking at that. We're looking at the finish line and trying to get there first. If we are in the same heat, we try and use it to our advantage. He's also been world champion before and uh, has a ton of skill, so we just uh, we just try and use our brotherly love and get through it. Brotherly love. That's, I feel like you're saying that with a hint of, like, it's not always love. Yeah, no, uh, for sure. Like, he's won, I've won. We yeah. can beat each other any day of the week, so um, hopefully the track's good for me and he can follow me down. The action kicks off on Friday with the Junior Championship and Freestyle Comp. The main event set for Saturday where the top 64 men and women will try and fight their way to the final race.